everyone and welcome back to another episode of Portal 2. I gotta get outside and see that this. This is a vault, isn't it? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's going on, but I see a door. Do not enter. Open door. I know how to open a door. So, I think we're entering an. Well, last episode, we got betrayed. We got betrayed by a certain someone. Wheatley. And turned GLaDOS into a, into a potato. Whoa. That's a lot of sludge at slash acid. Yeah, I know. I know that. I know. I've been. Why does that look like Samurai Jack out of all people? Come on. Can't be serious. Oh yeah, they're revising Samurai Jack for a fifth season. Uh. What's that noise? What does that say? Hey. Where? Where's GLaDOS? The potato GLaDOS, I mean. <gasps> what was that? Oh my god, I have no idea where I am. Okay. Oh, I didn't even notice that this door was open. All right. Pull lever. Huh? <gasps> Aperture sight. Astronauts, war heroes, Olympians, you're here because we want the best, and you are it. I wonder who that is. So, who is ready to make some science? I am. <laughs> now, you already met one another on the limo ride over, so let me introduce myself. I'm Cave Johnson. <gasps> I own the place. I swear I've heard that name before. Now I understand where it came from. That eager voice you heard is the lovely Carolyn, my assistant. Rip. That's what the sentry uh, turret mentioned. Her name is Caroline. My god! What's going on here? To sure she has transferred your honorarium to the charitable organization of your choice. Isn't that right, Carolyn? Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson. She's the backbone of this facility. Pretty as a postcard, too. Sorry, fellas. She's married. <laughs> She's married to science. Who the hell was playing that? No, I have no idea who was playing that. Where am I? Wheatley, I still can't go over to betrayal, man. What made you want to do this? I can't believe I trusted him. I mean, he changed. I mean, he changed as soon as he uh went for it or something. What am I even doing up here? <clears throat> Whoop! 
Okay. Oh, I guess you go up there. Well, unfortunately, I can't go up there. Still, I've heard Cave Johnson before. I've heard that I've heard that name before. Honestly, before I even started playing this game, I heard that name before. <coughs> Sorry, I just choked on spit. Okay. Main lift. Notice, please excuse the inconvenience. The elevator is out of service until I don't know. I don't know where I am. <clears throat> Seriously, he's like, I am King Johnson. I own the place. Now you call it a place, it's a mansion. Bigger than a mansion, anyway. Cause something fell. And it was this thing. Maybe I should go over here. I don't think I can go back. Nope, uh, that wasn't even a choice at this point. <sighs> Maybe I could use that to get somewhere somehow. Uh, I wonder. Maybe I can use it. <gasps> yeah, now I got it. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Here we go. Ah! Damn it. Okay, here we go. <laughs> We're supposed to get there somehow, but like this, like this. Ah! No! Oh, I dropped in a hole. Wait a freaking. Ah, I know now. Or at least I think I know. Uh, ah! Freaking frick. Mm. I need to start thinking about my plans, seriously. Oh my god, I can't believe I actually made it up here. How do we get up there?
No, the better question is how do I get up there? I don't even know how I got up here. What the hell, man? I am Kate Johnson. I own the place. Okay, so Wheatley thought I was being jealous. No, I mean stubborn. Oh, no! Ah, frick. Looks like I'll have to do it again. All right. Whoo, boy. I was actually really close to the gaining victory. Ah! I need to start thinking about my strategy, seriously. Oh my god! This is actually stressing me out! Not really. I'm fibbing. Can you really, can you really ignore fib? Yes, I bet you can. Uh, yeah. Now we go all the way over here. I don't even know how, why this even fits with the game. So, we go up here. Alright, I guess we'll go up here. And now we get through here. For no freaking reason, I don't understand how or... How? How are we supposed to get over there? Is a better question. <gasps> I have no idea. I have no idea! You do realize that there's no way to get back. There's no way to get back. Seriously. Prove me wrong because I, I can't get back. There's gotta be a way to do this. Like this really has to be a way. <clears throat> okay. Now I get it, oh my god. I wasted so much time. I've wasted so much time. You can skip past this if you want. Like speed, like speed up the footage, editor. Please do that. Oh my God, that was so much easier. There's a thousand tests performed every day here in our enriched hemispheres. I can't personally oversee every one of them, so these pre-recorded messages will cover any questions you might have and respond to any incidents that may occur in the course of your science adventure. Your test assignment will vary depending on the manner in which you have bent the world to your will. Those of you helping us test the repulsion gel today, just follow the blue line on the floor. Those of you who volunteered to be injected with praying mantis DNA, I've got some good news and some bad news. Bad news is we're postponing those tests indefinitely. Good news is we've got a much better test for you, fighting an army of mantis men. Pick up a rifle and follow the yellow line. You'll know when the test starts. Oh my god. There's where I was. Uh, okay. Elevator control up! Oh, that says Aperture Science Innovations. That's what it says. Zoom. Oh, boy.
Nope. Yep. If you've cut yourself at all in the course of these tests, you might have noticed that your blood is pure gasoline. What? That's normal. We've been shooting you with an invisible laser that's supposed to turn blood into gasoline. So what? all that means is it's working. Oh my god, that's seems... Just a heads up, we're gonna have a superconductor turned up full blast and pointed at you for the duration of this next test. I'll be honest, we're throwing science at the wall here to see what sticks. No idea what it'll do. Probably nothing. Best case scenario, you might get some superpowers. Worst case, some tumors, which we'll cut out. <laughs> wow, what a big jerk he is. What a big Superman he is. Just a heads up, we're gonna have a superconductor... If you need to go to the bathroom after this next series of tests, Please let a test associate know, because in all likelihood, whatever comes out of you is going to be cold. Only temporary, so do not worry. If it persists for a week, though, start worrying and come see us, because that's not supposed to happen. That's definitely not supposed to happen, huh? His voice reminds me of the Camp Camp Counselor. Camp Camperson, or whatever it was. A Rooster Teeth series, or... I don't know what I'm doing anymore. Where are all of the characters? Okay, what I'm supposed to do, I don't get it, I don't get it. Can't press the button. Here we go. Oh no! Here it comes. Ah! All right. Oh my God. I went through the thing. What kind of sorcery is this? Maybe I can get off from here. This is my stop. Or not. I really don't know where I'm going. Oh, I get it now! Alright. Let's do it. One, two, three! Come on! You're joking, right? Right? You're joking? <laughs> oh, that sucks ass! That still doesn't make any sense. Let's get this for real. If you liked this video, check out the annotations at the end of the video. There's only to see you in the next one.